Angela Deem and her surprising friend are being called a frightening duo by 90 Day Fiancé viewers, who are shocked to see the two villains together. Angela Deem and Lisa Ham, known as the worst combo in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, recently took a selfie together, causing fans to react negatively. Both Angela and Lisa have been labeled as nightmares and a problem by fans due to their disrespectful behavior towards their partners and others. While Angela has shown respect towards Lisa, both women have a history of causing drama and have been involved in controversial situations within the franchise. 90 Day Fiancé star Angela Deem scared fans when she took a photo with one of the franchise's biggest villains. Angela, 56, has been with TLC since 90 Day Fiancé. Before the 90 Day Season 2 when she went to Nigeria to meet Michael Al Sandy for the first time. Angela and Michael faced challenges in their relationship because he cheated and she was insecure. Her insecurity translated into loud screaming and pointless arguments with Michael because she thought he was always cheating on her. Angela and Michael did get married, but it's not like that helped solve their issues. Angela recently posted a selfie with Lisa Ham on her Instagram stories, which was shared by a 90 Day Fiance update. Known as Baby Girl Lisa because of the nickname that her ex-husband Usman Soja Boy Umar gave her, Lisa looked happy as she posed for a selfie with her new friend. Angela and Michael joined 90 Day, the last resort season one while on the verge of a divorce, but have been able to make peace in the relationship thanks to the therapy sessions. But it's not like Angela has changed into a calmer person over the years. She's still the same and is even fraternizing with fellow cast members from the franchise who are considered villains just like she is. Oh ye. The two worst 90 days fiances ever. Both are nightmares, a fan wrote after seeing the photo. Uh, the worst combo of castmates down together in any setting, added someone else. One fan referred to Lisa and Angela as a problem. They commented that the two ladies shouldn't be allowed to be together at all costs. Lisa and Angela were also referred to as a frightening duo by a different fan. Lisa debuted in the 90 Day Fiancé universe much later than Angela did, but fans were quick to notice the similarities between the two women. Both of the American blondes began dating younger Nigerian men they met online and dreamed of getting married to them. They didn't agree to adapt to the lifestyles of their Nigerian husbands and expected the men to be easily controlled. Not only did Angela and Lisa consider themselves better than their partners, but they also acted impolitely with their friends and family members. Lisa reportedly got fired from 90 Day Fancy when she used the N-word for Usman. She denied the claims but never appeared on the show again. Lisa was referred to as Usman's ex-wife and cut from his scenes when he began dating Kim Menzies. Meanwhile, Angela has always shown respect towards Lisa. She may have felt that Lisa was wronged by Usman in the relationship. Angela never got along with Usman. She accused him of being a scammer and giving a bad name to Nigerian men. In turn, Usman also accused Angela of scamming Michael because she allegedly used Michael's money to build a house for herself. It wouldn't be surprising if Angela and Lisa met to bed mouth Usman now that there are rumors that he flirted with former 90 Day Fiancé cast member Courtney Rudin.